friends, my name is Ariane. I am a luxury travel advisor based in Vancouver, Canada, and today I am waking up to a beautiful view here at Trissara in Phuket, and I am so excited because we are actually doing a cooking class this morning at Blue Elephant Cookery School in Old Phuket. So I do have to get going down to breakfast. I'm probably gonna have quite a light breakfast because I'm still quite full from our dinner at Sway last night. And yeah, I wanna show you guys the view right now. It's absolutely stunning. The I will do a full room tour once I get back from the cooking class, so stay tuned to that because Trisara really is an amazing uh, resort. It is all villas here and uh, each one does have their own private pool. So really excited to show you what my room looks like once it's all made up because obviously my bed's a little messy from sleeping in it last night. So I'm gonna head down to breakfast and I'll show you what we get up to at the Blue Elephant Cooking School. So let's go. Trissara is a beautiful five-star all-villas property located on the ocean on the west coast of Phuket. It's about 20 minutes south of the Phuket International Airport. The outdoor breakfast area overlooks the beach and is a very relaxed vibe with wonderful service. The breakfast is served both buffet style and is also a la carte. The avocado toast and the French toast topped with fresh mango were my favorites. The portions were also the perfect size, not too large. I also had a fresh coconut every morning with a latte. It truly was the perfect start to each day. As the Trissara property is quite vast, we took a golf cart from the breakfast area to the main lobby where we met our guide and driver to take us to the Blue Elephant Cooking School in the Old Town area of Phuket. Get about five or ten minutes walk. Okay. To exercise before you eat a lot. Okay. You're gonna make the yummy food by yourself yeah. for your lunch today. So let's exercise. We walk from here to the market and then we buy some ingredients. And then we come back to cook. Okay. In the market, if you would like to taste something, just let me know, okay? okay. We were then off to the market with Molly, who would be our chef guiding us this morning in our cooking class. She made a couple stops along the way to the Phuket market, explaining some of the Thai foods and produce we saw. Once at the local Phuket market, we were shown some of the most popular vegetables, herbs, and other food items used in Thai cooking. It was a very stimulating experience in regards to the sounds and the smells. After we picked up a few ingredients, we headed back to the Blue Elephant Restaurant and Cooking School, where we were given a workbook and our recipes we would be making for our lunch. Chef Molly did a great job explaining each dish and doing a cooking demonstration. Then we would go out and actually cook the dish ourselves. Blue Elephant Cooking School and Restaurant founder Chef Nunur Somani Step actually came down from Bangkok to meet our group. It was such a lovely surprise and so nice to meet her. 
The cooking class was so much fun and we cooked two dishes each. As I don't eat fish or fish sauce, they made accommodations for me and I was given a substitute ingredients to use. If you do book this cooking class, be sure to let them know if you do have any dietary restrictions as they can accommodate most of them. Afterwards, it was time to enjoy our creations. They also served us some chicken saute and some pad thai along with a delicious dessert. If you ever visit Phuket and are looking for a cooking class, I highly recommend the Blue Elephant Cooking School. It was such a great experience. We then boarded our vans where we were taken to the center of Old Phuket for some free time and shopping. I took this time to admire the Sino-Portuguese architecture and the street art in this district. It has turned into a bit of an Instagram spot, however there are some great places for coffee, ice cream, and boutique shops in this area as well. to a tour of my oceanfront pool villa at Trasara. I stayed in villa number 208. It had absolutely stunning views of the ocean right from the infinity pool and deck area. It was very private which I truly enjoyed. Inside the 240 square meters or almost 2600 square feet villa, there was a very comfortable king size bed, workspace with desk, living room area and an absolutely massive bathroom. There was also a fully stocked mini bar, an espresso coffee machine, custom Trasara blends of loose leaf teas, and a fully stocked mini fridge. The bathroom had a separate vanity and makeup area and a very private outdoor shower which was amazing to use. There was also an indoor shower, toilet room, double vanity sinks, and a very large bathtub. The bathroom also overlooked into the bedroom which had shutters that could be closed, however I personally left them open for the stunning ocean views over the pool.
There was also a huge amount of closet space, with one of the closets housing a safe and this statue, which was the Do Not Disturb sign, which you would leave out on the pathway to your villa, which signified you would like to be left to moments of privacy. It was such a beautiful villa and I'm so grateful to Tresara for hosting me here for three nights. If you're looking to book a stay at Tresara, please reach out to me in the description box down below as I'd love to help you reserve your stay here and as a thank you, I'll add a special amenity to your stay when you book through me. We finished off the night with a site inspection of the nearby Anantara Layan Phuket Resort followed by cocktails and a delicious Mediterranean inspired dinner. So I am again all ready for bed. <laughs> I hope you enjoyed today's episode. I had such a great time at the Blue Elephant cooking school here in Phuket. Highly suggest it. Um, it was a fantastic cooking class. I always try to do cooking classes wherever I travel. Let me know in, this, in the uh, comment box down below if you've ever done a cooking class where you've traveled and which one you've done. So yeah, such an amazing day. I hope you also enjoyed my room tour here of the Trisara. Uh, again, I have an ocean view pool villa and it's an absolutely beautiful property. So if you enjoyed this video, be sure to give it a thumbs up and also be sure to hit that subscribe button down below. Thank you so much again to the Tourism Authority of Thailand for hosting me on this trip. And then also to Trisara, Blue Elephant, and all the other activities that we've done. It's been such an amazing trip here to Thailand so far. So thank you so much again. I also want to thank you for watching. It does help support my channel. So definitely be sure to hit that subscribe button. See you next week. Bye.